Right, so Jada said he's 35, got his own place, successful, but I'm 23. Is that okay? Um, right. If I give my honest opinion, would I want my 23 year old sister to be with a 35 year old man? Nah, the answer is no. No, but that's my little sister. So obviously, I'm going to be a bit more biased and more protective than that. But, um, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, you know what? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. T -t -t yeah, 35. I mean, it's a big gap. It's a fucking big gap. You know what I'm trying to say? He's four years too short to be your dad. To, 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 yeah, but, yeah, you're probably better off going with an older man, to be fair, rather than some young dude. Because uh, Most young boys, they ain't got their head screwed on them, man. So he's got his own place. So, yeah. That's one thing I was talking to my girl about the other day as well. So now there's like a shaming tactic going around when let's say like a man who's 30 wants to deal with a girl who's 19, yeah? And I was saying to my girl, um, I've seen videos on like Instagram and that, because this is before I was on TikTok. I saw videos on Instagram where girls are saying that, ah, if a guy is 30 years old and he wants to deal with a 21 year old, he's creepy and that. Like, he wants to uh, manipulate her and that. And I was explaining to my girl, if a 30-year-old or a 35-year-old man gets hold of a 20-year-old girl, he's actually saving her from herself. Imagine, yeah, you have two chicks, yeah? You have Chloe and you have Ellie, yeah? They're both 19 years old. And let's say... Um, Chloe gets with a 30 year old man I know the, the age gap is mad But just hear me out Chloe's 19, she gets with a 30 year old man If she's with that 30 year old man For 3, 4, 5 years She's going to have a body count Of one extra and that's it Yeah. Whereas if the other girl Ellie is 19 But she don't have um, An older man who's a boyfriend And she's just out doing what she, she wants to do And fucking about living her life and that her body count is going to go up by about 15, 17, 18, 19, 20 men. Yeah. So when a girl gets with an older guy, he's probably going to save her from herself. So, I mean, I, I don't think it's a bad idea certain times, boy. I said, bro, when I was, bro, when bro was 10 when she was born. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I get what you're saying, because even my girl was saying that. But I just feel like if a girl's with a younger guy, yeah, there's going to be a lot of foolishness going on, breaking up. And I guess, obviously, yeah, you know, you got a point if she did stay with a younger guy. And that. But I, I just reckon... And the thing is, yeah, all right, boom. Maybe, maybe there's no difference in her staying with one younger guy and one older guy. I'll give you that. Fine. Because my girl did say that, innit? Yeah? But at least with the older guy, he's going to have more knowledge and more experience in life to be able to die there. Oh shit! I've got an age restriction on um, this uh, live stream for some reason. Anyway, with with the young with with the older guy, he can he can guide the girl. Yeah, he can give her advice and that he can show her what to do from what not to do. I mean, I know that should be the par uh, the parents' job and that, innit? But you know what some parents are like. A lot of parents are not fucking qualified to be parents. So the guy can guide her. Yeah. And drop knowledge on her and that. So, whereas a, a guy that's her age, more than likely, ain't gonna be able to do that. At the same time, do I want my twenty-three-year-old sister to be a thirty-five-year-old receding hairline, fucking bull patch, almost man? Um, maybe not. <laughs> I'm trying to say so. Yeah. 